wanted to do with this tour was make it a very personal show. There is Joseph and there's Jungle. You know, there's a lot to tell. What do I think of my fans? Well, fans are everything. They're a bunch of nutters, but so am I. It's perfect. It's a marriage made in heaven. I have been a fan for four years old. I've been counting down the days. I actually cannot wait to see him tonight. He's my childhood sweetheart. Our childhood. Fifteen years of loving Jason Donovan, and we finally got to get here together to see oh, him. every day, in every <laughs> way, we love you all.
Well, I said that I would be here And I would never let you down People come and people go But you're the one that I want to know When you said that Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. What? Thank you, Matthew. We, uh, we've traveled many, many miles, and finally we have arrived here in London. And you know, and we were coming down late last night, having just done uh, Bristol, and we had a great gig, and we sort of turned off the Hammersmith overpass. And I had to, I just had to take a sneak look behind and I could see Jason Donovan Hammersmith upon me. It's great. You know, um, it was funny the other day, speaking of London, I was going up to Marble Arch and I, and I, and I was heading down Park Lane and I looked to the left hand side and I could see the Grosvenor House Hotel. <laughs> you know. And I, and I thought, look, I'm going to drop in to my dear friend, Mr. Guest. Um, David, uh, David opened the door as in his very warm and, and secure self, and we sat down and we had a little bit of a chat. And then, lo and behold, this is a true story, and in walked Virginica. Now, 
She is a mystery to all you people. She ain't a mystery to me. She was staring at me right in the face. And behind her was little Platina, semen. Now we got discussing about the tour and our likes and dislikes of where we've traveled. And she has a very fond spot. <laughs> I know, I know. She has a very fond spot for the people of London. So you should feel, and I have to say, I think it was Memphis or one of the places that she lives in, but it was a very dry climate out there. And she finds the moist, the wet, the damp of this town far more appealing. And I had to pass you on that message because it's all true. Whatever. This, uh, this next song I want to play for you now is a new song. Uh, bear with me. There is a, a MySpace site which uh, promotes uh, some of this material. It was uh, written by a person who is here tonight, I believe. Uh, for most of you, and God bless you, have followed my story over the years. It hasn't always been... It hasn't always been uh, rosy. But I tell you what, now, at this very point in time, it is a good day. And this is the song. Inside. 
I do, a, I do a lot of talking, I talk, I talk a lot, I talk about myself, I talk to myself, I discuss my life, I have feel, um, I feel over the last six months I have done so many interviews about getting to this particular place, um, that I don't need any form of psychiatry, um, but enough about me, let's talk about you and what you think of me. I, uh, oh, okay. I spent, uh, I spent a, a funny part of the end of last year making a very difficult decision in my life. Do I do reality television? Yeah. Big question. Big question. Jason Donovan, CV. Look down. Joseph. Uh, any dream will do. Stock Acre Woman Neighbours. Uh, Rocky Horror Show. Drug abuse, Sweeney Todd, Festin, I'm a celebrity, get me out of here. Where does that fit into the campaign? Where does that go? Where do we go with that? Well, we cut to Queensland, we make the decision and we decide to do it. Who cares? What is cool? You tell me, what is cool? So. To expose the characters, yes, we all had to do uh, a lot of eating of a lot of rice. And if you put it all into perspective, actually at the end of the day, thank you, there are far worse people off than myself and all of us here tonight. I had the opportunity to get a great suntan. I got paid, which is always nice. I met some gorgeous people. Uh, and uh, I did a lot of talking to myself. The one thing I will tell you is I am going to play you another song, okay? It's a new song. Now, before you all go, oh, really? Okay, I, I paid 22, 25 quid to see too many broken hearts, especially for you. I don't do I should be so lucky, because I am lucky. Uh, <laughs> and uh, every day and any dream will do. Well, can I just tell you, ladies and gentlemen, just take the time back to think, maybe tonight is an education as well, okay? Yes, you will get your money's worth. We deliver, we say what we want and what we need, and we will give you those songs. But tonight, I want you to walk away, possibly, and think, I went to that Jason Donovan gig, and you know what, he played a few songs, and the old ones, oh, they were great, fantastic. Wow, I remember those so well, and actually, some of his new stuff is not so bad either. With me? Let's give it a go, talking to myself. Listen to the silence while I'm thinking of the time When love was in a promise Of the beauty of your smile And I'm staring at your picture In the glow of candlelight If you walking through the door And back into my life I hear someone say It's gonna be alright but I'm talking to myself
My heart is beating loudly Cause it's you I can't resist And I'm turning back the pages Of the stories that we wrote Of everything we said we meant That gave us so much hope But still I hear you say It's gonna be Let's give you what you want.
talk. Cool, huh? Let me tell you a little story. Um, well, Ange and myself and the kids live in a, uh, a small, modest house in Notting Hill. And this particular Saturday, we'd been out the night before to my sister's birthday. Um, 
We got home quite late. <laughs> and the phone kept ringing relentlessly, as it does. I'm not sure all of you know, but I am an Australian, and sometimes people, people get the, uh, the time wrong. And this phone call kept ringing relentlessly and relentlessly. I decided to ignore it. Mobile, fine, mobile phones usually tell us, you know, who's calling. I finally relinquished at about 8.30 in the morning. I picked up the phone. And it was Angie's brother, Tony. I could tell something had gone horribly wrong. I passed the phone to Ange. And... You know, I could just see by the expression on her face that uh, my fears, you get, you get a feeling, you know. Um, Oxford is where she's from and where her families are from. And like the M25, it's surrounded by an eastern bypass. This particular night, seven kids were in a car some wearing seat belts, some not. Something we're all guilty of a little bit in our lives. Um, they were going from a house to a party. Now the reason why I'm telling you this story is to a certain degree we've all grown up together. I'm sure a lot of you guys out there have this going on. Josh was 13 when he lost his life that night. He was Angie's nephew. He was a son. He was a human being. And I guess you're asking, why, why, why are you going down this path? Well, because what it taught me that day is we all get very obsessed by possessions. You know, we have plasma screens, we have the latest mobile car, fax machines, telephones, new house, you know, going to work. Sometimes we lose focus. We lose focus on these cliched things in our lives. Spending time with people, family, friends. Now, I'm sure Angie's nephew and Jane, if they could turn back time, like we have right now, would spend more time with the person that they've just lost. What I'm giving you is just an opportunity to think through the power of music. If I could leave you with something tonight is how this song has written a signature under Josh's name. I recorded it the following day. It's an absolutely beautiful song. Bear with me for another three and a half minutes. I want to dedicate this to the most precious gift I have, and that is
And I'll be here to catch you Cause I'm so amazed by you I've waited up and I'll weigh it out For your love I have no doubts Every night I hear your words Mesmerized by you Now that you're standing on your pedestal so tall And I'll be here to catch your love Cause I'm so amazed by you Every night now, when I sound You step inside my dreams I can't hide it, cause I've decided Just how much your beauty means To me here holding on Waiting for your love Drop into my arms Now that you're standing on your pedestal so tall Begging you to jump before you fall And I'll be here to catch you now Cause I'm so amazed by you Standing up, begging you to jump before you fall. And I'll be here to catch your love, cause I'm so amazed by you. Cause I'm so amazed by you. So where, uh, where do you come back from that? Um, <laughs> um, you get back on your feet and you keep walking. That's what you do. Jules is on my right hand side. Stelios is on my left. Um, most of you are from your change of mind and question of pride are all familiar with uh, my involvement with Stock Aik and Waterman. Uh, and I guess a lot of you at the back are aware that um, that production process was um, quite quick, sometimes fun, um, sometimes interesting. Um, I, as a vocalist, over the years I was really pushed in. Well, not pushed in, I decided to that that was the door I was going to go through. Uh, thank God I did, because I discovered the love affair of music and the love, love affair of uh, the voice. I even discovered the guitar, and you're about to hear some of my interesting guitar playing. Um, along that journey, the one time that I did feel relaxed in the recording process was doing a cover version. And this next song from the album 10 Good Reasons is just that. Gotta say goodbye for the summer Darling, I promise you this I'll send you all my love Every day in a letter Seal it with a kiss 
Yes, it's gonna be a cold, lonely summer I'll feel the emptiness I'll send you all my dreams Every day in a letter See that with a kiss I'll see you in the sunlight I'll hear your voice everywhere
Our journey began back in 1985 with a, a funny little Australian television show called uh, um, and uh, we've been up and down, the journey has been long. I often wonder what Scott Robinson might look like these days. He, uh, the mullet would certainly have disappeared. Uh, he'd be losing hair in places that he didn't necessarily want to lose them and growing them in very places... Oh my God, what am I saying? Uh, you know what I'm saying. Um, but it has had its, its moments, its ups and downs and, you know, we've told a few showbiz stories along the way. We've, we've watched, you know, from, from Going Live and Philip Schofield through to... T4 and, and remember, okay, okay, I'm gonna take, I am gonna take you back here, you know. I'm trying to keep my sense of humor here and I'm trying to keep straight and everyone at the back up there at the top, I want you to do your best singing. When will I, will I be famous? When will I see my picture in the Leave it there. That's it. That's it. Still, uh, still got the uh, sense of humour. We've come. Uh, we have got. Well, we've come full circle uh, tonight. And I want to play you one more song. You might have uh, one more new song. No, it's not the end yet. <laughs> one more new song uh, that uh, you might have seen on your seat. It's a download only. I, I sort of see it as an opportunity to vote uh, me back into the charts in some way so that we can create a new story. This song was recorded about a year ago. Have a good listen. It's called Cheer My World.
So members of the family tonight are behind me who are making this all very rich and exciting and oh, I remember that song and um, you know, it's been a lot of fun. We're, we're sort of quite close to the end of this tour and we, uh, I think we've put together something really good. Carl on percussion tonight, who, uh, who really is the constructor of this ship um, and put the the pieces, the Lego pieces together. Aileen and Fern providing beautiful backing vocals, of course, looking gorgeous. Thank you, Jason. Carl, our bass player on the left-hand side. Uh, we've got uh, we've got Jules, you know, Jules, you know. Sylvester Stallone himself, Mr. Stelios, Stelios. Stelios. I want you to give a big round of applause to Sean. Sean has managed to, to, to put the components and parts uh, together to make this sound like it did back in 1989. And also, notwithstanding some of the new material, um, which uh, sometimes is a little less cluttered and uh, is allowed we can breathe a little bit more. We have a, a, an addition tonight. We have Sarah, Stella, Emma, and Linos are providing beautiful, oh, you know. I have got, Sean, this uh, thing going through my head. Um, what is it? It's a song, and uh, it's from the 80s. And I can't, I can't think of what it is. Hold on, hold on. What about da da What? Aha, uh -huh, okay, okay, okay. I am the one and only. Nobody I'd rather be. I am the one and only. You can't take that away from me. Now that, that is another fix. I am the one and only. Mr. Jesse oh. Hawks.
Thank you, thank you, Jason. Thank you, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Chesney Walls. The one and only. Where do you go from there? I think we've peaked, to be totally honest with you. Woo. Um. So, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh, it's all a dream. You know, the wonderful thing tonight is we're all caught in this web of music. And isn't it amazing what music can do to us? Um, in all its form, classical, pop, rock, and even a Jason Donovan record from 1989. How about, how about this moment? How about this moment? Not quite.
Wow. show you tonight at the Hammersmith Apollo. Ladies and gentlemen, wow. Thank you so much. That, I mean, what an absolutely perfect night. This is a dream come true. I cannot begin to tell you, um, the support and the love you have given me tonight. It's been about 15 years since I've had the opportunity to do this. I hope I don't have to wait so long the next time. But I can tell you one thing, as cliched as it may seem, tonight, standing right here, I am the luckiest guy in the world, so thank you.
So I just want to, uh, I want to um, um, firstly thank all those people who voted for me in the jungle because I can honestly tell you, um, whether, whether we like it or not, we make decisions like I said before and I don't think necessarily I would have been able to have a night like this tonight if I hadn't had that television exposure. So thank you to all those people. Um, I want to clarify one thing and uh, that I am uh, extremely happy with the greatest respect to my gorgeous friend, Matthew Willis. Uh, I'm happy to be known as the guy that didn't eat the anus. So, but here he is. There he is. Look at that man. Big round of applause for Matt. I love you. I love you. Beautiful. After. Has anybody been watching uh, Any Dream Will Do on TV? Isn't that funny? Uh, how camp is that show, you know? Close every door to me. I mean, um, I was never that happy looking at myself in a mirror with a loincloth and a sweaty jock strap. Uh, uh, I was fighting other demons at the time. Maybe I was overworked. I certainly wasn't underpaid. Um, but uh, it was a great experience for me and, and eight shows a week. And that discipline gives you the, the structure to be able to, to do what we're doing here tonight. And again, some of us aren't that lucky to be able to walk down this road. Thank you so much. What an amazing night. Thank you. Shall we get on with... One, two, three. That's it. I close my eyes, drew back the curtain to see for certain what I thought I knew. Far, far away Someone was weeping But the world was sleeping Any dream will do Sebi I wore my coat With gold lining Bright colors shining Wonderful and in the east The dawn was breaking And the world was waking Any dream will do Here we go, the chorus And a crash of drums A flash of light A golden cone Flew out of sight Oh, I made a mistake there. To the beginning, the light is dimming, and the dream is too. World and I, we are still waiting, still hesitating. Now, 
heart shaking. We have a problem because Jules absolutely loves shaking his balls. And we do. Okay, all right. Close my Through back To see for That's it What I thought I knew And we'll stop Far, far out Someone But the world Any dream will do We'll go to a corner Let's see, here we go. And the crash of drums, everyone! Golden coal flew out of sight. Colors faded into darkness. I was left alone. To the beginning. And the dream is to we'll stop the world and I. We are still waiting, still hesitating. Here we go. Any dream will do. Any dream. Any dream. Any dream. Any dream will do. Here we go. Can we all see it one for the last time? Because tonight, ladies and gentlemen, you can all be Josephs. Any dream will do. Fun stuff. Lots of fun.
so much guys I have had the greatest night of my life I have to say to you you've made it very very special I will never forget this thank you so much <laughs>